So you wanted to talk, right? I did want to talk. So about? About this relationship. And it's wonderful, right? I mean, it's pretty good. It could be better. What do you mean, could be better? I mean, I just feel like as far as effort, I'm putting more effort into the relationship than you are. Effort? Yeah, effort. What do you mean? What, what kind of effort? I mean, like, to try, like, to compromise, you know, to be more understanding. I get it. But you know what I've been through, and it's a little difficult for me. I mean, I understand that. I understand that. But you have to think about this right here, you know? If you want to walk through a door, you have to close the door that you just left through in order to go through another door. So until you close that door and leave those things behind, I feel like you shouldn't try to walk through this door right here. We've been together for over two years now? Yeah, two years and you're still hanging on to things that you've been through before me. And I don't think that's fair. You're right. So you think we should break up over that, though? I mean, if, if we don't break up, I think that we definitely need some space so that you can understand what you have now and stop focusing on what you had in the past, what you went through, and focus more on what you're going through. It doesn't make any sense. It makes a lot of sense. I just, I don't like that we have to separate. I mean, well, what is your um, solution? Because you said for years, for two years now, you said that you were working on these issues. In two years, here we are, you're constantly going through the same issues. I feel like I'm trying. You know? You don't feel like I'm worth holding on to, or I mean, I just don't get. I mean, it's not about you know, you being worthy of holding on to or not. That's not the situation. You definitely are. But at the same time, am I willing to accept and to continue being, you know, the absorbing factor of what you've been through? Okay, I get that. Um, because I didn't send you through those things. You're right. I so it's that. not for me to sit here and be you know, your punching bag, you know, however, whether it's going to be verbally, emotionally, psychologically, it doesn't matter. Right. So how long is this separation supposed to be? I mean, you'll come to your moment of realization. Well, I don't want to separate at all. Well, I mean, when are you going to start acting different? Towards me. When are you going to start appreciating me more? I appreciate you. You say that, but I think that a lot of times our words have to reflect our actions. You're right. And I know it's me. I know it's hard for me to let go to hurt from the past, and you has been, you have been good to me. I don't know how to get over it. I just feel like it's best to let you go before our relationship becomes toxic. You know, I don't want to dislike you. Mm -hmm. This can work. I've been trying to make it work.
see this shit is hard to beat feel the seconds feel the minutes with passion and heat correcting time looking back on life love is a blanket a beautiful quilt truth be told i do it again rewrite the story keep the love